Welcome to Linda Z's Thursday morning, and we are here today back at the store. We are celebrating a second year anniversary with taking on the Janome line of soy machines. And so we are here in front of one of their top of the line sewing only machines. We're excited to extend even our brand, Janome brand in our store. We're about to add the multi-needle embroidery machines. So there's a four needle and a seven needle that we'll be adding to the lineup. And then you might see some surprises in the middle as well and down towards the entry level of the Janome line as well. Today, we're going to focus in on the Continental M8 machine. It's a beautiful machine. And so why don't you come on over and we'll take a look at some of the features of this beautiful sewing machine. So here we are close up to the Continental M8 Professional. Look at how big this bed is. It's uh, one solid piece of, and, I, and we like to say just how solid these machines are, but this particular machine is very large sewing space and it also does come with a tray that uh, slides right on here so you can have even more space. The space is incredible. We're almost at 14 inches. We're 13.7, I believe, inches from the needle over to the throat. Look at the lighting. Isn't that gorgeous lighting? All of that, that light, it, it makes it um, just very easy to sew with. So there are so many functions. Why don't we go over a few? Um, the machine itself comes with, well, the, the freehand system, of course, the knee lever. So that is going to help you um, lift when you're working on the project. You, you lift your presser foot and lower the feed dogs, and it just uh, helps you to do any pivoting like that. Um, we've got, with the machine, I wanted to show you the larger foot control, and then they've thrown in with this machine the thread cutter. So this is an extension that they give you a bar uh, for underneath that you attach these two together, and then this is an, ex an extended thread cutter, so you can do just th cut your thread with your feet. So that's also a very nice plus with this machine. Um, they, uh, they do have uh, also with all of their machines, but particularly with the M8, they have the AccuSpark um, app that you can use on your phone. It basically um, gives you every kind of function that you could do with this machine on your phone. So you could be anywhere learning about your machine and then you come home and you have these great ideas. So you have the stitch chart, the sewing preparation, machine functions, manual stitch functions. Um, it goes over the presser feet, machine settings, and then you do have videos of a lot of these functions um, on this AccuSpark 2 app. And so that's available wherever apps are available on your smartphones. So that's great. And then just wanted to, to show you some of the buttons on, so you've got this really large screen in the front, which is great. Your needle threader is right here on the side. So it's very accurate needle threader. And what you do is you lock your needle bar first in place so that it is in the right position to uh, accept the needle threader. So you have, you have the ability on this machine to uh, very quickly change out your stitch plate from, this is a zigzag stitch plate, and I would maybe want a, a straight stitch stitch plate, or the HP, which is also another function that's very, very cool with the Janome machines. Uh, so here we are, we go up to our screen, we lock the screen, and just now you get ready because I push this button here on the screen and autom automatically the stitch plate does come out. And so that's how easy it is to switch our stitch, stitch plates from one to the other. So there you go. That's, and then to put it back in, it just accepts it back. And then they just warn you to, to uh, then we unlock the screen. And that, that was just how easy it is to change that stitch plate. So here we have uh, different buttons. The, the needle up, needle down is right there. Scissor cutter, our presser foot up, presser foot down, our reverse button. And then we have our speed dial here, our start and stop. And then on the other side of the screen, we have the stitch width and the stitch length knobs. Those are great. But what you have here, um, we didn't, I don't want to pass by something that's a really cool feature that's just like the CM17. It is your ability to raise and lower the needle with the knob here. So that means that I can test to see where my needle is just by by touching right here. So I don't have to go over to the, the hand wheel or even press a button up here. I can be really close to my work and I can see where my needle is going to touch down on my project. So that's a very cool feature with this machine and gotta love that for sure. We've got um, all different of the utility stitches. We've got some of the buttonhole stitches that are here. Then we go into the decorative categories and there are two pages of that. Looks like there is a QR code. So every time you see these QR codes here also, that leads you to more information. 
um, straight from Genomia, which is great. And then we have the monograms. So you have all kinds of different monogram um, designs. And there's over 400 um, designs built in um, to this machine. So here you've got the ability to taper all of these stitches in here. So just look that you can do tapering at the top of it and tapering at the bottom of it. So that's really cool that you can use that uh, function. <clears throat> so inside this, uh, so if I go back to where we were, that was this t-shirt icon here um, from our homepage. And we have three icons at the top and they inside those three icons you have presets. And again, you have a QR code if you really want to go farther into more detail. Genomi has done that for you, which is great. And there are three pages of this, but just to name a few here, we have a rolled hem, we have some top st stitching, we have a curve stitching, over edge heavy, a blind hem. So just to name a few, and then if I scroll down even more, lapped zipper gathering. So th there, everything you could possibly imagine doing, uh, smocking, faggoting. So, so very awesome. And then the next icon on the top goes into patchwork piecing, free motion quilting, ruler work quilting, variable zigzag, applique. So once you choose these individual settings and you go into it and make, make your choices, then the machine is set up for you and you are ready to actually sew in that actual category. So I just chose the free motion category and I can do the straight stitch one, straight, straight stitch two, a zigzag stitch in free motion. I could do the straight stitch three, four, and a zigzag two. So there's all of these different variations of sewing that you can do. And so if I choose that, I just have to make sure that my proper presser foot is on and then I can just, uh, and I need it to, it lowers my feed dogs for me already. And again, I have another QR code to go into the different functions as well. So this is a very, very useful features of this machine because it, what it does is it gets you started on your project and the machine sets it all up for you. So it's like it's doing the work for you. All you have to do is decide exactly what kind of, of procedure you want to go through, what kind of uh, project you're doing, and then the machine sets it up for you, which is really great. So it, see how it says it's, it's uh, lowering the feed dogs because that's what the icon is. So for free motion, the, the feed dogs do go down and you are the one who then moves your project underneath that needle. So who is the kind of person who would want to purchase a Continental M8 professional machine? It is for the person who is garment sewing, who is quilting, who is making bags, who needs a workhorse, right? So if you need to go through a ton of uh, leather layers of leather, this machine can do it for you. It has a lot of power. Um, is the space, the light, uh, the, all of the functionalities inside, it's really a top of the line sewing machine. And so just wanted to give you a little bit of a, of a brief discovery, a, a, an introduction to, to this machine that I personally love. You have a cabinet here that you can put into this machine into. Um, at, right now we have the 6700 that's in this cabinet but it's also made for the M8. So the only thing you would change is the insert. So this uh, cabinet has the insert for the 6700 memory craft right now. So I actually have one of these in my personal sewing room. It doesn't take up a large footprint. So if you don't have a lot of space in your sewing room, but you wanna be able to put a sewing machine in um, like this one or that one, <laughs> um, it's definitely not taking up a large space, but it's a very solid, solid cabinet. And so you've got two drawers here and some storage, and it's just a really nice, really nice uh, uh, cabinet. Okay, so that's um, in a nutshell our M8. If you are interested in seeing any of, we have some wonderful professionals here at Linda's Ease that could show you the whole lineup. We have a lot of the Genomis. Like I said before, we're adding more to our lineup of Genomis. So we're thrilled about that. We do have special pricing on this particular machine. It was featured in one of our most recent events. And so we've got a few of those classroom machines that are left. They were barely used and the pricing does reflect that. So it's, if you are interested, now would be the time to look at this machine for sure. We've got machines on our website. We have machines that are for sale. This particular one is only uh, for sale in our store, but we do have other machines that are similar to this that are available on our website, so check it out. And um, just love to, to help you guys buy your next Genomi machine. And that was Thursday morning video, and I hope to see you next week. We will go further into another Genomi machine next week.